We've had an update on the terrorist takeover of the Nakatomi building. Sources say the terrorist leader Hans may be this man, Hans Gruber, a member of the radical West German Volksfrei movement. Strangely, the Volksfrei leadership issued a communique an hour ago stating that Gruber had been expelled from that organization and is operating on his own. Well, obviously, Gail, whatever his affiliation, I think it's safe to say that Gruber's terrorist actions in Los Angeles tonight are, well, terroristic. Sources say the terrorist leader Hans may be this man, Hans Gruber, a radical... With me is Dr. Hasseldorf, an acknowledged expert on worldwide terrorism and author of Hostage Terrorist, Terrorist Hostage, A Study in Duality. Dr. Hasseldorf, what can we expect in the next few hours? Well, Gail, by this time the hostages should be going through the early stages of the Helsinki Syndrome. As in Helsinki, Sweden. Finland. Basically, it's when the hostages and the terrorists go through a sort of psychological transference and a projection of dependency. What can only be described is a strange sort of trust and bond develops. We've had situations where the hostages have embraced their captors after their release, and in one case, even corresponded with them in prison. It all depends on what we mean by terror. If Clausewitz could say, war is the last resort of diplomacy, couldn't we then just as well say that terrorism has an equal claim to being that too? Well, Gail, by the time, or by this time, I'm sorry, <laughs> uh, Finland, oh, sorry. Oh, God, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I goofed. Psychological dependent. Oh, dear, I'm sorry. Ay, ay, ay. It should be embrace their captors. I'm sorry. Oh, boy, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Give me the mic. Hold on, I've got a problem with this mic. Al? Give me the mic. Lucy? Yeah. Yeah. You know your mom and dad are very brave people. So? Is there anything you'd like to say to them? <laughs> if they're watching you now? <laughs> Come home. <laughs> Thank you. How about John Jr.? No, I don't want John Jr. Okay. There's no grandstanding, all right? Just keep it on Lucy. Keep it on Lucy. How you been? How you been feeling? Bad what? Bad. Oh, bad. Whoops. I can't. I got a light. There. You know what your mom and dad are doing and how important they are. Do you know that? How important they are? Yes. So you're proud of them? Yes. Okay, very good. Now, just start the same question again. You know, your mom and dad are very brave people. You know that. So is there something you'd like to say to them, if they're watching you now? Come home. Thanks a lot, Lucy. Hey, Lucy. Okay. Hey, don't smile. Okay. Don't smile. Okay. Don't smile. okay. Can you hold Pauline's hand? Hold my hand. Fred, go a little more to your left. Can I Todd, can you come up much closer this time? Yeah. Come up on the side. There you go. There you go. Oops, I've got a left. Okay, and tilt down a little. Go to your left, Wilfred. Tilt down. Yeah. Just go for the girl. Huh. Okay, and go ahead. Bill, go ahead. Listen, you know, your mom and dad are very important people. They're very, very people. So is there something you'd like to say to them if they're watching? Come home. Thank you very much. see them for a long time, you know. They are really, really not coming home. You understand? They're not coming home. Okay. But I'll let you talk to them. You know, your mom and dad, they're having a very hard time. And they're very brave people. So is there something you'd like to say to them? If you could? If they're watching? Come home. 
video guy pushing him, pushing him. Do it again. You know, your mom and dad, they're very brave people. They're very important people. Is there something you'd like to say to them? If they're watching you now? Come home. Okay, bring it out one more time. Let's do it one more time. And wait before you say, before you say, come home, all right? Just a long time, okay? Just wait a long time, okay? And video guy, while she's saying it, or just before you push in. Okay, one second. And, okay, cut. Stay back. I don't want you scaring him. Stay back. Okay, give me the mic. Give me the mic. Lucy? Lucy, you know, your mom and dad, they're very important people. You know that? And very brave people. So is there something you would like to say to them now? If they're watching you? Guy, you lean to your right. Okay, and go ahead. Next. Lucy, you know your mom and dad. They're very important people. They're very brave people. So, is there something you'd like to say to them if they're watching you? Come home. Okay. And cut. And action. Mr. McLean, Mr. McLean, Mr. McLean, now that it's all over after your incredible ordeal, what are your feelings? I don't know. I don't know. We never. Entertainment tonight. Like I said, we never were racist. I don't know what we're doing. Come on. Mr. McLean, M Mr. McLean, now that it's all over after your incredible ordeal, what are your feelings? Did you get that? 